Hey guys, so this is going to be my first YouTube video and I'm very excited about it and I hope that whoever is looking at this video enjoys my first video and thinks that I will make better videos while I didn't think I would make I would use the word video so much in a sentence. Oh, okay, so let's start with the basics. Um, in the beginning, they're going to give you either spacers or expanders. I got expanders because my mouth was not how do I say this, shaped or formed the right way. Like my mouth was way too small for my teeth, so they were all crumbled up. So for that, I had to get them spaced out or expand, so I got expanders. I got those for six months and then I got my spacers. A lot of people get spacers for two weeks, one week, maybe three weeks, maybe less. I got them for two weeks and my tip on expanders is do not play with them with your tongue I would always play with them with my tongue and they would always fall off and I had to go to the dentist and get them back put like put them back in and my mom would kill me do not play with them it's gonna they're gonna be like play with me play with me do not play with them because when they fall out and you have to tell your mom mom taking to the dentist is going to suck because it hurts putting them in um Another thing was with spacers that I didn't say about expanders. Expanders hurt for the first two weeks, but then you're good. Spacers, on the other hand, hurt a lot. They hurt. You can't eat, you can't chew, and they tell you to drink with a straw. I would bite the straw because I like biting my straws when I drink from them. I don't know why. I'm not the only person that does this, but whatever. Um, I bite my straw and I bit it by accident. And oh my god, I was in so much pain for the next hour. So be very careful. You're going to be um, drinking a lot of liquids. Well, that's one thing you drink. You're going to be consuming a lot of liquid and a lot of like bleh, jiggly and like loose stuff. Not like solid stuff. That sounds really weird. But yeah, that's the, that's the first stage. The second stage is getting the actual braces. So this hurts. The procedure of putting them on does not hurt at all. Like, the only uncomfortable thing about that is that your mouth is open for a good, like, two hours. And when they, like, take it out, you're, you're like, your lips are like raisins. They're like, oh. That was really weird. But, yeah, the process of putting them on doesn't hurt. Now, two hours after you put them on, yeah, that hurts. Um, That hurt a lot. Like, I, I remember I was, like, really young when they put them on, and I would get a fork, and this would hurt me more, but I will get a fork and put them in between my brackets and try to pull them out, and I will be like, take these off of me, and that would only irritate my teeth and make it hurt worse. And, oh my god, I was in so much pain for the first month, but I got over it, and now I'm good, and it was, like, normal. My tip is use the wax. They're going to give you a little packet that has a lot of different things like floss, um, wax, a toothbrush, a lot of different things. And use the wax. The wax are like little wax strips that you put on the brackets that are like scratching your gums. I, I still have scars in my gums from those brackets. The first month, there is non-stop scratching and it hurts and it hurts and it hurts. The next and then the rest of like your treatment with the braces, it doesn't hurt and it doesn't get caught as much, but it still gets caught once in a while. I have to like pull it out. Like you see, I'm like eating and all of a sudden you, hear, you, you see me like, and my friends are like, are you readjusting your jaw or something? I'm like, no, I'm just, I got stuck and it hurts like a lot. And they're like, ha ha ha. I'm like, no, it hurts. Wait till you get braces. Anyways. So yeah, that's the only thing I can really talk about braces. I think that one of the favorite, like one of my favorite things about having braces is the colors. I would always like put different colors on and stuff. Now, if you don't want your braces to show and your mom's know you get the clear braces, well, I'll talk about like in a second, then get silver um, rubber bands. What this does, it kind of camouflages it in a way. My, my friend told me to wear the silver ones and I did and it worked a lot and it looks really cute. So you should do that. And now I'm going to the clear ones. Clear. There is an option where to get the metal braces and brackets or to get the clear ones. If you don't want them to show, get the clear ones. They're not going to be com like completely invisible. But they're going to be like... Uh, 
I don't know how to say it. it's not transparent it's like a plasticky kind of clear on your teeth but if like you smile from mile away they won't see it don't worry and for pictures it looks really pretty uh, but if not just get the clear ones or you can get the ones uh, if not you can just get the metal ones if you don't care about the clear ones or you can get them inside on the inside of your teeth instead of the outside I don't really recommend that because it scratches up your tongue and it hurts a lot it hurts more than when you put it in the outside but you know there okay so for the third stage is rubber bands um three months before you take your braces off they're gonna tell you to wear rubber bands they're really 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 was well, big but like really 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 tiny rubber bands so you have to stretch and everybody has different like ways of putting the rubber bands my one was the simplest the, the one to fix your rubber by is from here to here to here my friends was from here all the way to the middle of their teeth back over here it's very very weird Say something. Rubber bands suck. They suck. They suck. Like you don't want to have rubber bands, but you need to wear them. I made the decision of not wearing them because they hurt. Now, what happens? I would wear them for two days. It would hurt too much, so I'll take them off. And then I'll wear them like in a week or so. It will hurt too much, so I'll take it off. You have to wear it for that first week. That hurts a lot, and then you'll get used to it, and then you keep on wearing them. If you don't, and you choose the pass that I took, which was wear them every now and then, or even not wear them at all for a good month, you would delay you taking off your braces. I, delay, I delayed my taking braces off, whatever, three months. I could have taken my braces off three months earlier than what I did, but I didn't because I didn't wear the freaking, the freaking rubber bands. Suck. Leave them the day, the late freaking braces take off. Whatever. Removal, not take off. Um, they suck. They hurt for the first week. But then you get used to it. My only tip to that is to wear them, to not cheat on it. Cause I would tell everybody that I'm wearing them, and then the and when I got to the freaking dentist, they wouldn't take off my braces, and I would get really mad. But it wouldn't matter because it's on me. So yeah, my only tip for that is to wear them, wear them, wear them. Okay, so it comes a day, you take off your braces, you're very happy. Now, they're gonna mold your teeth that same day for your retainers. I got my retainers three days after I took my braces off. Yeah, three days. Um, they mold your teeth they, and then it takes about three days to make the retainers. I have my retainers right here. Um, they don't ask for the color, they just give you one, and luckily I didn't get like, I don't know, clear. I don't know if they have clear, but I'm just really happy with the color that I got. Um, I'm not going to show you them because that would be kind of gross, but it's, you get them here, you have to wear them. For the first six months, you have to wear them all day and just take them off to brush your teeth and to eat food. Um, and then after those six months, yeah, the six months, you just wear them to go to bed for the rest of your life. I'm not wearing them right now. I think it's been six months. I think my stubborn self don't like to do this. And my mom said that one of my teeth was moving already. So my tip for you for that is to wear them please wear them if you don't wear them then your teeth will just go right back to where they first were my friend stopped wearing them though she was like that is some bull caca like it's not true it's not real they just say that because whatever 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 and i was like whatever that's what you want to do that's your life if you want to wear your teeth you wear your teeth like that's I don't care. It's not my teeth. My teeth are perfectly straight right now. Like, best job first. Anyways, um, so she didn't wear them, and you would slowly see that her big tooth would go over her other tooth, and I would keep on commenting. I'm like, look at your teeth. Feel your teeth. Do you feel that bump? It's not normal. It's going back to where it was. And she was like, oh my god, you're over exaggerating. I'm like, whatever. And then one day she came to school and it was such a big difference. It was after spring break and her teeth were completely different. And she, I was like, you better wear those retainers like right now. And she took them out of her book bag and she was trying to put them on and they wouldn't fit her teeth anymore because her teeth changed so much. So there she goes again, 
um, putting more braces on on the only top part of her braces, only on the top part of her teeth, not braces, sorry. And it just got so chaotic. She was like crying. She was like, I finally took them off, not put them back on again. Like, you were right. Everybody was right. My teeth weren't moving, blah, blah. We're like, we told you. We told you. But you were like, no. Anyways, <laughs> we're your entertainers. Okay, guys, so that was the end of my first video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys like me. Hope you guys, I don't know, just hope you guys are good. You guys are fine. Um, so, yeah, subscribe, like, comment, ideas. I don't think you guys are going to comment or anything because it's my first video, but that's what people say. Just like and give me more ideas of what to do because I have nothing right now. Nothing. So yeah, stay beautiful.